Edward Keith Styron, magna cum laude, pastoral ministry. Anthony James Tabor, summa cum laude, pastoral ministry. Lydia M. Thomas, Evangelism, Cum Laude. Gail Weaver in Absentia. Everett C. Waymeyer, Pastoral Ministry. The Associate of Arts may now turn your tassel. <laughs> Will the candidate for the Diploma in Christian Ministry please rise? By the power invested in me by the state of Louisiana and the board of directors and with the recommendation of the academic dean and faculty of the college, I confer upon you the diploma in Christian ministry with all the rights and responsibilities appertaining thereto. Venus Diana Floyd. Venus, you can turn your tassel, too. <laughs> Will the candidate for the certificate in church growth please rise? By the power invested in me by the state of Louisiana and the board of directors with the recommendation of the academic dean and the faculty of the college, I confer upon you the certificate in church growth with all the rights and responsibilities appertaining thereunto. Anthony C. Mahaffey. Turn your test. <laughs> Will the candidates for the Biblical Studies Certificate please rise? By the power invested in me by the State of Louisiana and the Board of Directors, and with the recommendation of the Academic Dean and the Faculty of the College, I confer upon each of you the Biblical Studies Certificate with all the rights and responsibilities appertaining thereunto. Sharon Elaine Barton, magna cum laude. Mark D. Brown, Carla K. Brom in absentia, Monica Beth Cesnoros, Wanda Deal. Ronald 
L. Dinsmore. Kimberly M. McKinney Edwards. Daniel Mark Franco in absentia. Rebecca Joanna Freeman. Wesley M. Hill, cum laude. Samuel J. Pretty. Emily Ann Reitman. Magna Cum Laude. Daniel Raymond Smith, in absentia. Timothy Staples, Cum Laude. Jonathan W. Todd. Marilyn G. Weimar, cum laude. Juanita Moore West, magna cum laude. Norman Royce Wilkerson. Ann H. Wilson. may now turn your tassel. You may be seated. Thank you. The world that you're going out into is never pleasant and never has been, but you have the one anchor, the Lord Jesus Christ. You have one power, the power of the Holy Ghost. You have one message, the gospel of the kingdom, and you are equipped not because you've come here. We pray that we have contributed a tiny bit toward that which God has touched your heart with, but you are equipped because of what Jesus did at Calvary and what the mighty power of the Holy Ghost is continuing to do within your heart and within your life. Hold your head high. Square your shoulders. What you have is bigger than a million devils because Jesus lives within your heart. Go out and win the lost at any cost. Go out and bring in the sheaves, rescue the perishing, and care for the dying. Go out and let the world know that Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Go out and preach the Word. Preach it without compromising it. Preach it without favor. Preach it because the preach is within you. Live it because the liver is within you, Jesus Christ. Uh, proclaim it because He is Lord of Lords, King of Kings, forever and forever. Forgive me, I'm going to preach myself. Hallelujah. I almost feel sorry for the devil looking at you. Would you stand, please, and would you gather around this octagon? We want to pray for you and ask God's gracious and glorious blessings upon your heart 
And I want those that are seated here to come and stand nearby and just stretch out like you're coming to be prayed for if you're sick. <laughs> Hallelujah to God. Aren't we proud of them? Aren't we proud of them? Don't we thank God for them? Jesus Christ is Lord. Hallelujah to God. Praise the name of the Lord. Could you give me four flats, please, um, Charlene? I I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Three flats. Could we sing it just before we pray for them and as they're coming? Jesus is the sweetest name I know. up your hands and sing it one more time. Just one more time. Everybody now. Jesus is the sweet Praise God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Heavenly Father, as these young men and young ladies stand before us tonight, they stand with anticipation. They stand with excitement, and yet they stand with burden and responsibility. They stand equipped by the power of Almighty God. <laughs> Called by the highest hallowed halls of heaven. And in the mighty and glorious name of Jesus, we give them the charge to walk uprightly, to live righteously, to walk in holiness, and in the name of Jesus, to proclaim thy ways in all that they do, whether they be in the professional world or the ministry. May they rescue the perishing. May they care for the dying. And I will ask that thy blessings and thy help and thy grace would go with them and be upon them and be within them all the days of their lives. And may they go on from here to victory, to victory, to victory. And in the hard moments, and there will be some. May they believe God. As Paul said on the decks of a storm-tossed ship, 
Sir, I believe God. And we say it all in the holy and the most gracious and the most glorious name of Jesus. And everyone said, Amen and Amen. Brother Stenhouse, thank you so very, very much for an excellent message. Didn't it bless you? I'm telling you, when you leave here, when he closed his message, the power of the gospel can get down into an atheist heart. You couldn't leave with anything any better. Satan put forth his best, and heaven had no trouble cracking it open and putting the love of God in it. Praise God. Thank you for that. And God love your heart so much. Praise the Lord. You may be seated. We're going to have a recessional.